Dennis just came back from the doctor. You don't look happy. Did the doctor give you bad news? No, he said I'm healthy. My body is fine. That's great. It's not great. I'm still fat, but not because I'm sick. I'm probably fat because I eat too many snacks. So, just stop eating snacks. Soon you'll be slim. That's my plan. Today I'm saying goodbye to chips, candy, and cookies. I already drank my last soda. That's a big change. Can you really do it? It will be hard, but I'm strong. I could do it. You'll see. Hi, and welcome to ABC Interactive English. I'm Mike. And I'm Mary. And welcome to this month's edition of our monthly focus unit. We are going to be looking at some good health advice this month as we say goodbye to snacks. That's right, Mike. More and more people are becoming aware of some of the unhealthy things that might be in some of our favorite snacks. That's right. Things like fat, sugar, and salt. If we eat just a little of these things every day, that's usually fine. In many cases, our bodies need these things. But it's when we eat too much unhealthy stuff. That's when we might be facing some problems. Before we begin reading the dialogue through, we need to take a quick break to check out all of today's new vocabulary. 在今天的对话一开始，我们的主角 Dennis 刚看完医生回来。Maggie 问他，医生有和他说任何坏消息吗 ？Dennis 就回答，没有。医生说他很健康。健康的英文是 healthy， healthy， 这是一个形容词。例如 ，My grandparents are both very healthy. My grandparents are both very healthy. 我的祖父母都非常的健康。另外，医生除了说 Dennis 很健康以外啊，他还说 Dennis 的身体也很好，没事。好的，顺利的，英文就是 fine, fine。这是一个形容词哦。例如 ，Don't worry, I'm fine. Don't worry, I'm fine. 不用担心，我很好。那在听完 Dennis 这样说以后啊 ，Maggie 说。那这样很好啊，但是 Dennis 说他觉得不好，因为他还是胖啊，可能是因为啊他吃太多零食了。这时候 Maggie 就跟他说，那就不要吃零食啊，这样很快就会变瘦喽。那瘦的、苗条的是我们的第三个单字，英文是 slim， slim， 这是一个形容词哦。例如 ，Daniel exercises every day and has become very slim now. Daniel exercises every day and has become very slim now. Daniel 每天运动，现在变得非常苗条。那回到对话里，接着 Dennis 回答：“不吃零食就是他的计划。”听到 Dennis 说的话 ，Maggie 就问他：“那是很大的改变哎，你做得到吗 ？”Dennis 的回答：“的确很难办到，可是我心意坚定，我做得到的。你等着看吧。”那这里啊，有我们最后一个单词 ：strong，strong。Strong, strong. 坚定的、坚强的，这是一个形容词。同学们要注意，这里的 strong 不是指具体的、强壮的，而是比较抽象一点的、坚强的意思哦。例如 ，You can do this. You are strong. You can do this. You are strong. 你办得到的，你很坚强。那看完了单词案例句，让我们一起回到课文里吧。Dennis just came back from the doctor. You don't look happy. Did the doctor give you bad news? No, he said I'm healthy. My body is fine. That's great. It's not great. I'm still fat, but not because I'm sick. I'm probably fat because I eat too many snacks. Explanation one. Okay, so as we mentioned earlier. Our unit for this month is titled "Say Goodbye to Snacks," and before we begin reading the dialogue, we should go over to Daphne for our first grammar point, which is found in our title. 大家好，我是 Daphne。今天的第一则文法是 "Say Goodbye to Something"， 意思是告别某事物。Say 在这里是及物动词说的意思，三态为 say, set。Sad. 
后方结束话的内容当受词，在这个片语里面就是 goodbye 再见，后方再用介系词 to 上引出说话的对象。Say goodbye to something. 字面意思就是向某物说再见，引申指不再做某事。例如 ，Adam said goodbye to eating out. 亚当不再外食。注意，介系词 to 后方要接动名词 eating. Welcome back. Part A of the dialogue begins with a sentence which reads. Dennis just came back from the doctor.、Mm, and our other character named Maggie, well, she sees Dennis, and then she says to him, "You don't look happy." Uh oh. And then she asks, "Did the doctor give you bad news?" And Dennis replies, "No. He said I'm healthy. My body is fine." Okay, well that isn't bad news at all. No, certainly not. The doctor didn't tell Dennis that he was really sick or anything like that. I wonder why Dennis is looking so upset. Well, let's read on to find out. So Maggie hears that the doctor was happy with Dennis's checkup. So she says, "That's great," but is it? Dennis still looks worried. And so he says to Maggie, "It's not great. I'm still fat, but not because I'm sick." Ah, I see. So Dennis is fat. He's overweight, and he thought it might be because he was sick with something. But the doctor has just told him that isn't the reason why. As Dennis continues, he says. I'm probably fat because I eat too many snacks, so it looks like someone will be going on a diet. It sure does, and we'll find out what happens with Dennis right after this quick break. So, just stop eating snacks. Soon you'll be slim. That's my plan. Today I'm saying goodbye to chips, candy, and cookies. I already drank my last soda. That's a big change. Can you really do it? It will be hard, but I'm strong. I could do it. You'll see. Explanation two. Welcome back. Dennis has just returned from a visit to his doctor, and he has gotten some bad news. He's not sick or anything, but he is overweight, and so the doctor wants Dennis to go on a diet. This seems to be a simple solution to his problem, but Dennis seems pretty upset. His friend Maggie notices this, and as we get back to reading, she says to him, "So, just stop eating snacks. Soon you'll be slim." Right. It isn't too complicated.、Mm, not unless you are a person who really loves your snacks, and I get the feeling that is what Dennis is upset about. He says, "That's my plan. Today, I'm saying goodbye to chips, candy, and cookies." Wow. Good for you, Dennis. And that's not all. He also says. I already drank my last soda. Oh, it's so bad. His last soda. His last soda. <laughs> yeah, it's like he's saying goodbye to some friends that he'll never see again. Goodbye, junk food friends. I'll miss you. But if you do love your snacks like Dennis does, this would be a big change. Imagine giving up something you love, like playing your favorite sport or video game, or not being able to use your favorite apps or hang out with your best friends. It wouldn't be easy. Yeah, or even giving up your smartphone. <gasps> We would feel sort of lost without these things and moments that give us so much happiness. That's right. Well, Maggie, she seems to understand. That this won't be easy for Dennis, so she says that's a big change. Can you really do it?、Mm. And we will wrap up with Dennis's answer to that question 
after we go to Daphne for our second grammar point. 今天的第二则文法 ，That's a big change. 意思是那是很大的改变。代名词 that 代指前文提过的事情。Change 在这里是名词改变的意思。前方用形容词 big 表示改变的程度很大，合在一起。That's a big change. 就是那是很大的改变。例如 ，You have caught bands. That's a big change. 你剪了刘海，那是很大的改变。So Maggie was asking Dennis if he would be able to really give up eating all of his favorite snacks, and Dennis then tells her, "It will be hard, but I'm strong. I can do it. You'll see." Good for you, Dennis. He really seems to be determined to get back in shape. He sure does. And we have our final grammar point here. We'll check that out and then finish up for today. 今天的第三则文法 ，you'll see， 意思是等着瞧吧，为口语表达法。You 是 you will 的缩写。Will 是助动词将会的意思 ，see 则是不及物动词知道了解，合在一起。You'll see 字面意思就是你将来就知道了，用于说话者对自己说的话很有把握，要听话者等着瞧的时候。例如 ，The show will be fantastic. You'll see 这场表演会很精彩，等着瞧吧。Okay, so that's it for us. We'll see all of you back here tomorrow for day two of the monthly focus unit. Bye bye. bye. Dennis just came back from the doctor. You don't look happy. Did the doctor give you bad news? No, he said I'm healthy. My body is fine. That's great. It's not great. I'm still fat, but not because I'm sick. I'm probably fat because I eat too many snacks. So just stop eating snacks. Soon you'll be slim. That's my plan. Today I'm saying goodbye to chips, candy, and cookies. I already drank my last soda. That's a big change. Can you really do it? It will be hard, but I'm strong. I can do it. You'll see. <笑>欢迎收看就爱讲英文我是悠悠我是吉安超高气爽的日子来了好像恋人谈恋爱呀你有那个恋爱的对象哦不要讲我害羞对真的哈很明显的哈哪有那我们有啊都写在脸上了
，对的人，嗯、我想唱歌了。对的人，呃，算了，啊、可以了。<笑>对的人，英文怎么讲？是吧？怎么讲 ？OK， 就是 someone that is right for me。Someone that is right for me，、嗯、就是真命天子啊，真命天女这样。哦、oh, ，英文就是比较常讲什么？什么 Mr. Right， Miss Right 吗对对对对对对对 ？Mr. Right 就是男生哈、哦嗯，那 Miss Right， 嗯，就是。女生这样 ，OK。I wish to find my Miss Right。我想找到我的真命天女这样。Oh, 那你要找谁 ？I wish to find my Mr. Right、嗯。对，可是你知道，把妹搭讪、撩妹很重要。对，撩哥也很重要哈、哦。这个开场白很重要哈。这个搭讪的这个词哈，英文叫做 pick up lines。Pick up lines。对，就是要怎么这一句话出去。就很有效果，这样就叫 pick up lines。Pick up lines。对，所以要慎选这个把妹、把弟、把哥的这个搭讪词啊。You need to choose the proper pick up lines. You need to choose the proper pick up lines. 对对，就是你那一句话出去哦，就决定成败了。好了，这样你就要好好练习。好，对。好，我们来看今天的 life action. Oh, what? Autumn's here, right? It's the coffee season <gasps> again. Yeah, I wish to find my Miss Right. <gasps> Me too. Uh, I want to find my Mister Right. Mm -hmm. I hit on a guy the other day. Yes, what happened? But he wasn't interested. Hmm. What should I do? What should I do? What should I do? Well, maybe you need to choose the proper pickup lines. Hello, 大家好，我是 Hanny， 又到我们一分钟的单元喽。我们今天要用一分钟的时间来复习在 Monthly Focus 学到的四个单词。同学们，您都准备好没？一分钟计时，开始。好，第一单词是健康的，健康的英文是 health。那健康的呢，就是在 health 后面加一个 y， 就变成形容词 healthy， healthy， 健康的。Fried foods are not healthy for you。油炸食物是不健康的，对你的健康不好哦。再看第二个单词是好的，顺利的。以前老师都会叫 How are you？ I'm、um,。Thank you. 那个字是什么 ？Fine, fine 就是好的，顺利的。The doctor said that her throat is fine. 医生说她的喉咙好好的，没有问题。第三个单词是瘦的、苗条的。苗条的要怎么说呢？叫做 slim, slim。好，它就是瘦的、苗条的。The model is tall and slim. 那位模特又高又苗条，身材超好的。再看第四个单词是。强壮的，强壮的，它还有别的意思，叫坚定的、坚强的。那是哪一个字呢？就是 strong, strong. Ron is not strong enough to handle the problems himself. Ron 不够坚强，没办法自己处理那些问题。太好了，我们在一分钟之内顺利完成四个单词的复习，同学表现很棒哦。那回去也要多多复习，多多造句练习。今天的 A B C Interactive English 到此为止，下次见喽，拜拜。